大家好 ，It's time for another episode of Growing Up with Chinese. 欢迎收看今天的成长汉语。Thanks for joining us today. Last time we talked about making phone calls in Chinese. Today we're going to be focusing on transportation. Now, in the United States, along with many other countries, when kids live too far away from school, they have the option of taking a school bus. Now, most public schools in China do not offer this service, but that's mostly because China has quite a developed public transportation system. Take Beijing for example. There's the subway, public buses, taxis. There are even bike lanes on most every road, so that people can bike virtually anywhere. So today, Xiaoming and Mike are making their way to school. Let's see how that evolves. Mike, 快起床，快起床，我们睡过了啊。现在几点了？七点半了，快点。小明，你平时怎么去学校？我平时先坐公交车，再到地铁。不过今天太晚了，我们打出去吧。师傅，我们去七十四中学。对不起，我不太认识，你能帮我指路吗？好的，您先直行，到长安街十字路口再向右转。好的。哎。怎么这么堵啊？我给你们停地铁站吧，坐地铁会快一点。好的，谢谢您。麦克，这是地铁一号线，咱们可以到东单站转五号线。啊，哎呀，快点来车吧。Oh no! It's never nice when you sleep in by mistake, especially if you have to be somewhere at a specific time. But Xiaoming was definitely full of ideas on different ways to get to school. Let's take a look at some of what was said. Mike, 快起床，快起床，我们睡过头了。Mike, quick, get up, quick, get up. We've overslept. 睡过头 is the phrase overslept. 你平时怎么去学校？ How do you usually get to school? 平时 usually or typically, 怎么 in this case makes it a question functioning as how. 去学校 get to school or go to school. 你平时怎么去学校 ？Mike， 快起床，快起床，我们睡过了。啊？现在几点了？都七点半了，快点。你平时怎么去学校？我平时先坐公交车。I usually take the bus first， 再倒地铁 ，and then switch to the subway. There's a sentence pattern here. 